Hi, my name is Tim Hatt, and I'm the head of research and consulting at GSMA Intelligence. I wanted to introduce a report that we are releasing ahead of MWC uh, in partnership with our friends at ZTE uh, on sustainability and how this is moving to become a core business principle in telecom networks uh, as the industry and its partners move to net zero. The context for this doesn't even really need explaining. Uh, put simply, there is a strategic imperative to reduce energy consumption and ultimately CO2 emissions, uh, both to assist in the fight against climate change uh, in the wake of the Paris Accord and, and most recently COP26 in Glasgow, and within the telecom sector uh, to help reduce costs in an ever-rising data traffic environment. We know that as 5G takes hold, and we forecast it will reach over 2 billion connections by 2025, or over 20% of the subscriber base, that data traffic will rise inexorably and push operating costs related to energy, which we already estimate are about 20 to 40 percent of OPEX higher. So what are the types of innovations that are out there to help this? Well, we know a lot is being done in distributed automation, uh, the move to cloud, especially the use of AI for network planning and network functions optimization, um, as well as refinements in air conditioning to smarter systems and battery technology. All of these are really helping operators move towards carbon neutrality uh, in their paths to net zero. Ultimately, though, this is a holistic challenge. When we talk about a green 5G era, it isn't just 5G. It's also about optimizing costs from legacy infrastructure, which is why, or one of the main reasons why 2G and 3G networks are being sunsetted over time, as well as making sure that fleets and other operations are as energy efficient as they can be. This is an industry-wide effort and it is really gaining momentum. So we're excited to release this research and continue the conversation at MWC. Thank you very much.